Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only. Coming to you with another episode of New Vegas. Alright, when we left off, we were, uh, finally finished after a long super episode <laughs> of trying to find all of the remnants of the Enclave for Arcade, our buddy. So, we're going to head to the bunker, which we had just found the passcode to, and I don't remember any of the words. Fuck. <laughs> okay, so. There's gonna be a couple Cazadors near here, probably. No? Should be some sort of enemy nearby. Huh. Well, anyway. Now I'm gonna deal with the water. Ah, uh, because that's gonna be a pain in my ass if I don't. Um, there we go. Let's check the stats and everything else. Food is not great either. Let's find something for food that I'm willing to eat. Um, iguana bits would work. Sure. At least lower it a little bit, wouldn't it? Yeah, food's to 75 now. Sleep's bugged again. <laughs> that's one of the worst problems of the survival mode in New Vegas is that the sleep is always bugged it's like what is the fucking point of that particular juncture then if it's bugged it's not even going to work right alright uh yeah we just got to keep going this way gotcha it's probably going to take a little longer than I intended to be perfectly honest, it is going to take a little while. So, we'll just continue the way we usually do. And uh, I'm hoping nothing shall attack us while we're doing it. But, hard to know. Okay, so. Just gonna grab stuff while we go. Is this, uh. It doesn't seem like it would be possible, but I should probably investigate it to see if that's the case. And no, I'm not seeing. Not seeing any entrances I could use. So, further onwards. Away! Well, why did my voice crack there? Away! There we go. That's what I meant to do. The voice crack was completely out of fucking nowhere. It's not like I'm dehydrated or anything. At least I don't think I am. Maybe I am, and I just don't know. That's a thought. Alright, so up we go. And we hit the snag. Where it doesn't let us go up anymore. Okay. So... Yeah, we just gotta keep going forward this way, huh? But, uh, it's a little hard to doing it this way. I wonder if I'll eventually hit the point where it will stop letting me go up. Huh. I guess I haven't yet. Which is good. I am getting closer. Just, when is the cutoff point? Where I'm not allowed to get closer. Um, those are Cazador nests. That can't be good. Oh, am I allowed to go any further than this? No. Okay. I've hit the point. Where the game says no. So, maybe I should try from Jacobstown. <laughs> I tried from Vault 22 thinking that would be a correct way. And that clearly isn't. So, let's try again. From an entirely different angle. I had to drink my coffee. I apologize. If I'm dehydrated, I might as well drink something that will slightly less dehydrate me. Just slightly. Okay. Onward we go. And 
Well, I mean, it already looks like this is probably the better path that I should have taken. So, <laughs> now I feel like an idiot. Then again, I'm just playing all of this by ear because I've never done it before, so. I'm just randomly guessing on how to do things. And then finding out if I'm right or wrong. It's been rather quiet. This little road we're taking. It's kind of nice. Oh, I spoke too soon. I spoke too soon. Giant Mantis. Well, I mean, not too much of a problem. Well, Arcade thinks they're too much of a problem. <laughs> But that's okay. Now the biggest problem is if there's bigger enemies. Oh, like that. Like that. Okay. And down you go. The young Cazador. Down you're gonna go. And that's it. Oh, oh, no. Okay, Arcade's fine, but should probably help him. And get that one gone. Arcade is okay. Alright, so. These we can actually get shit out of. So. Well, the egg, not so much. But it's weird that the mantis egg is more valuable than the cazador egg. Maybe because you can't domesticate the cazador, but you can with the mantis? Maybe? Mm -hmm. I'm just conjecturing here. Ouch. What do you mean, ouch? Oh! 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 Okay. He was getting poisoned by the Cazador poison. That's what the problem was. Oh, and he still is! Oh, mama! Sure, just don't treat me like a pack bro. Don't! Huh. Much better. Don't you use any of my stim packs that I gave you? Or is it you can't when poisoned? Oh boy. Alright, the last thing I need is him dying of Cazador poison before we even get there. Okay, we good? Good arcade? Good. Okay. Gonna heal him up a little bit. Jeez. This okay. Just Whoa. don't be lead the way. Huh. That is not the one I wanted. Ah, the stick made it goof up a little. And one more ought to do it. Oh wait, never mind. It says he's at three twenty five already. Okay. Alrighty. Good thing he said ouch. Otherwise I wouldn't have known that he was in trouble. And he would have just fallen over dead. And I would have gone, what happened? What happened? And found out it was Cassador. And I would have been very, very upset. Oh, hello. Remnants bunker. Oh, Jesus. Horatio Harold. <clears throat> Hubert Christ. Okay. It's a hole in the ground. Whoa. All right. Door control panel. 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 I can talk, really. I can't. Uh, do I sound normal when I do it? No, clearly, due to that voice crack earlier. But, I mean, that was intentional. <laughs> it appears that some sort of passphrase needs to be entered in order to open the nearby door. So... It is already saved into the 
Courier's memory. So, dear old friends, remember Navarro. So this is essentially Brotherhood of Steel. Against the Legion or the NCR. Alright, well, that might be a problem for that one guy. Alright, what is in here? Ho! Alrighty! Well, that's an up close and personal vertebrate right there. Got a fuel tank of some kind for it, I assume. Oh, I can't. I can't take these. I'm not allowed to. Okay. What is? Oh, hello. Enclave armor. Holy hell. Proper enclave armor. Look at that. You didn't even see this in the Capital Wasteland. This is this is the proper helmet for it. Man, look at that. Got six for all six of them. Look at that. Okay. What's up? Look at all this stuff here. For all you guys. Look at that. He doesn't want to talk about it. Okay, well, all right. What is in here? Oh, hey! The gang's all here. Hi there. So. I guess I gotta talk to him. Because he's the ringleader of the whole thing, I guess. Alright. Howdy. Hi there. Glad to see you made it here all right. Yep. So, who are we going up against? Alrighty. How are you going to deploy your squad? Marino, Johnson, Henry, and I will be the boots on the ground. Whitman will stay with the vertebird. Alright, that's fair. Um, what is this place? This was a minor refueling station for vertebirds. It seemed an appropriate place to stash our equipment if we ever needed it. Hmm. I'm surprised this place hasn't fallen apart. When I put it into standby mode, I expected to return to it within a few years, not decades. Well, I mean, it managed to stay up, so good for us. I want you to help the NCR hold on to the dam. Then that's the plan. We're going to have a problem with Moreno, though. Mm -hmm. He won't like that we're helping the NCR. You'll have to talk to him. All right. You're the officer here. Can't you just order him to go along with the plan? That's, that's not going to hold water well. I mean... <laughs> It, in the current military, that would, you know, still not be too good. That'd be kind of fucked of a CO. <laughs> but at the same hand, he'd still have to follow through on it. Here, there is really no law to keep him in check. He might just go AWOL. So, that's not going to happen. What's Moreno's problem with the NCR? Day one, we didn't. It's as simple as that. That's fair. The rest of us moved on while Moreno didn't. Yeah. Still, I'm not convinced Moreno hates the NCR as much as he thinks he does. You still might be able to talk him out of leaving. Really? Uh, will he be a liability? He won't turn on us, but he's a good shot, and I'd hate to do this without him. That's fair. I'll talk with him. You've got only one chance at this. I know Moreno. Once he's made up his mind about something, there's no changing it. Fair enough. Alrighty. Okay, he decided to go out the door. I didn't come all the way out here just so Whoa, we could okay. save the fucking NCR. I'm out. You are already in the Enclave armor. Okay. <laughs> Will caps change your mind? What are you doing? <laughs> oh, boy. The remnants come in, guns blazing, showing the NCR how it's done. You actually don't want that? I can't believe you've actually talked me into this. <sighs> Fine, I'm in. But don't expect me to hold my fire if any NCR troops get in the way. Hey, technically, 
Thanks for doing for just this. using them, them as a means again. to an end. I'll be honest. When Moreno started going off, I didn't think we'd all be walking out of there in one piece. Oh, yeah. I still don't know how this is all going to shake out in the end, but at least the Enclave can atone a bit for all the damage it's done. You've certainly done your part. I've been wondering about Daisy and the others for so long, I still haven't figured out what I should do. I mean, I'm not like them. I was born at Navarro, and my father served with them, but I wasn't really part of the Enclave. It seems presumptuous of me to think I could join the fight, even if this is a cause worth fighting for. Because I know when fighting breaks out of the dam, all hell is going to break loose in Freeside. They're going to need every doctor they can get. Hmm. Huh. If you're so sure it's going to be a bloodbath, maybe you should stay in Freeside. What happens in Freeside won't make any difference if the Legion takes the dam. That's true. Because if the Legion takes the dam, the entire fucking Mojave is at their, at their mercy. Or lack of. But, I mean, he does have a point. He's a good fucking doctor, and that would be shitty to just take that from them. But they do have the followers. They do have the followers, and they do have a number of good doctors and the followers, too. I mean, he was part of the followers. Fight with them. I'm surprised to hear you say that. I thought you had a problem with people who hold on to the past. Suiting up to fight against Caesar with the Navarro veterans seems like... I don't know, like a kid playing dress-up in his father's clothes. Well, I mean... You aren't like the others, Arcade. You're still young. It's up to you to decide who you want to be. True enough. Maybe I can't fill my father's shoes. I wouldn't even know how. But if following in his footsteps for a while means I can do some good out here, I'll do my best. I need to go do something. I won't be gone long, but I'll catch up with you later. Thanks for your help with the others. It means a lot to me. Oh, and he gave me the equipment he was wearing. Cool. Awesome. That was one of the things I was worried about. And I'm over encumbered. Fuck. <laughs> you have lost Arcade's better healing perk. And he's returned to Freeside. And... There's Moreno. Okay. Moreno's a stubborn son of a bitch. But he's also tougher than any of us. I'm glad you were able to talk him into staying. Me too. <laughs> Since Whitman will be staying with the Vertibird, she's offered to give her old suit of power armor to you. Really? You'll need special training to use it properly. So talk to her as soon as you get the chance. I'll talk to her then. The training might take several hours, so keep that in mind. Fair enough. Okay. I hear the Great Khans got massacred again. I... No survivors this time, though. I just checked on them. I, I checked on them after the recording. They're fine. I don't know what they're talking about. The Great Khans at Red Rock are fine. I'm assuming they're meaning that one location where we got into a fight with the Great Khans. That's the only thing I can think of. But I don't know. <laughs> anyway. Uh, let's talk to Daisy. I appreciate you keeping Orion in the group. Since I won't be needing my armor, makes the cockpit a bit cramped. You should yeah, that. It. It'll take a few hours to show you how to use it properly, so let's get started. Alrighty. And since I already have the power armor training, it wasn't necessary to do that, so leave the remnants command room so they can plan for the coming battle. Alrighty. For Auld Lang Sing. Hey! Got the last level up possible in the game. Alright. So. Where should I put the points? Honestly, I never really considered that. Considering it's the last possible level up I can do, I kind of want to just even out explosives and melee weapons. 
since I don't need sneak higher up than that. Quite frankly, I didn't even need to put sneak up that high. Um... Yeah, we'll call that good. Call that good. And the last level. So, we were good karma. So, ain't like that now, and just lucky I'm alive is not available to us. Huh. Which is a shame, because ain't like that now would have been great. <laughs> for a lot of things. But, thought you died. Your storied past has fallen from memory because everyone thought you died. Your karma is reset, you inflict 10% more damage, and for every 100 points of karma, you gain 10 health. You are also immune to critical hits. Which is a wonderful, wonderful perk to have. I've lost all the karma I used to have. But, uh... What's my health looking like now? Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. Uh, wow. Sheesh. Alrighty. Well then. That can't be right. There's no way that's right. 505. It went down. There's no way in hell. There's no way in hell. That doesn't look right to me. Alright. I am overburdened as hell. Okay. Luckily I can muddle through it just to get out of here. But fuck. Alright. So. Well, I didn't know you could zoom in without a weapon equipped. Huh. That's a wonderful little thing to find now. I didn't know that was a thing. Really? That was a thing the whole time? What? What? Oh! Like I said, I needed to go do something. Yeah! This is it. It belonged to my father. Since you convinced me to help out with the defense of Hooper Dam, I figured I'd haul it out of storage. I'm a little rusty with it, but I think I can manage. As long as you got my back, of course. Well, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. What's up? Uh, did you wanna... Did you wanna tag along with me? You don't. Okay. What do you think the others will do at Hoover Dam? I don't think you need to worry about the specifics. Basically, expect a lot of firepower and dead bodies. Enclave Fair technology enough. is even more advanced than Brotherhood equipment. And in the hands of soldiers as experienced as Moreno and the others, let's just say it's truly a sight to behold. Oh, I can't wait then. I can't wait then. <laughs> <laughs> this is going to be good. Alrighty. But for now, I'm going to have to go to the sink to drop off some stuff. Because... Actually, no. I can bring companions with me. A couple companions. Huh. I might bring a couple companions. I don't know who I'm going to bring, but I might bring a couple companions that I've had sitting in the Lucky 38. But, uh, for now I'm going to end the episode, because we're a little bit over time. <laughs> Not as much as we were last episode, but... 
Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and only Stray Cat playing games and finally getting the gang back together with, well, with all the power armor and equipment and crazy fucking shit that they have that will completely wipe away the Legion. And then we'll deal with the NCR after that. For you.